Hey YouTube, what's going on? It's me, Jessica, again, and I am back with my Kroger video. And um, I totally, totally killed Kroger today. Totally went ham and cheese on Kroger on these teas, okay? I was so excited about this deal because I had known about it from last week, but uh, the coupon I had wasn't really all that. And um, if you watched my CVS coup my CVS video from yesterday, you'll see that I um, talked about finding those 50 cent coupons for the Honest Aid. And um, I was able to do some real damage in Kroger today. So today was a great day for me shopping wise. Um, okay, so let's talk about these Honest Aid teas. They're called, uh, they're actually called Honest Tea. And they have the, um, they have a lot of great flavors and um, they're organic by the way. So you will only find them in the organic section at Kroger, okay? Publix carries them also, but Kroger has them on sale. Um, they were on sale at Publix for a dollar a while back, but um, Kroger, what makes this deal so great is because Kroger is doing um, different drinks like the Honest Tea and the, um, what is it? The Honest Tea, the Smart Water, the Vitamin Water, and the Fuse. Um, those drinks, and I think Gatorade is a part of it. I'm not sure, but all those bottled drinks. Oh, and also Gold Peak Tea is a part of it. All of those drinks are on the buy one, buy 10, get five free. And this is a deal. If you have these coupons, you really, really want to take advantage of this, okay? Because I have 47 bottles of tea that I got absolutely free. And, I, and I'm going to, I think I'll probably be going back to get some more, okay? Um, so basically they're buy, like I said, they're buy 10 and get five free and they're a dollar. So if you have no coupons, you're going to spend $10 for 15 of these bottles, which I'm not going to do. So anyway, yesterday I told you I went to CVS and on their, um, glass where the juice is, they had 50 cents off of one honest tea or honest aid product. Okay. And we all know that 50 cents will double to a dollar. So if the drinks are a dollar, you get them for free. And then you're going to get five more free just because you have to buy 10. Okay. So that's what makes this deal so great. Um, now if you don't, the 50 cent off coupons, I did find at CVS. So you can go to CVS and see if they have them. I'm not guaranteeing you that they'll find them there because every CVS is different. I was just very lucky, extremely lucky to go to my CVS yesterday and see, um, those, 50 cent off of one coupons and that is not CVS. I go to it pretty often, but not as much as I have been lately. Lately, I've been going to another CVS, but, um, yeah, so you can try that. Um, and also the 50 cents off of one, you can also find them in some gas stations. So it's not going to hurt to look around. Um, another thing is, um, if you don't find the 50 cents off of one, most times the, um, the drink itself will have a hang tag on it that says a dot 50 cents off of two, which will double. So um, you can end up paying 50, so you'll get um, a dollar off of two drinks, which means you'll pay 50 cents. So if you don't have the 50 cents off of one, the 50 cents off of two is it, it's pretty decent. Um, I have six of those, so I might just go back because I just want to use up all my coupons. Um, because I don't know when this deal is coming back and I really don't want to sit on it. So since I'm getting it for free, I just want to take advantage of it as much as possible. So um, basically, if you have 10 of the coupons, you buy 15 drinks, you give them the 10 coupons, you'll get your 10 for free and then you're going to get your other 5 for free. So it's just free all around. But like I said, you can look for the hang tag and you'll pay um, 50 cents for each item. So that means you'll pay $5 for 15 of them, which that is still pretty good okay so um i'm so excited um like i said a lot of times these drinks there are all there's so many coupons out there for these 16 ounce bottles of drink especially the teas um and normally they're always going to go on sale for a dollar somehow so you know you really want to take advantage i mean there really is no reason why you should even be paying for these anymore because it's so easy to get them, um, on sale for, you know, and, and not end up paying anything. So, um, this deal is going on. It's been going on since last week and I have a feeling it's going to be going on to the end of the month. I think this is one of those promotions that they're going to be doing all months long, like what they did with the all. So now this part of the video, this is my other transaction. Um, cause I wanted some juice. Cause remember I told you guys that I bought 
those dull um shakers smoothie shakers well you need juice to add to it i didn't really have any juice i have a lot of teas but i didn't actually have juice juice so that's why i got these um, the Welch's, which I love, the Welch's Passion Fruit, and I got the Welch's Strawberry Peach, and those are on sale at Kroger for $2.19, and we have some 75 cent off coupons, which made them about a dollar and 44 cents, and we also have some dollar off coupons, but honestly, I just decided to use my 75 cent off coupons first, because those are going to expire in uh, June 30th, and that way I'll have my dollar off coupons, because those are going to expire till August 30th, so at least I have some coupons that I can use for the rest of the summer, that's why I said, well, let me just use my 75 cents off coupons, okay, now these, um, teas, these are the Sweet Leaf tea, these are also organic, and I have the mint honey and green tea, and the, um, organic citrus green tea, so, um, those, I know you're probably thinking, well, why did I buy those if I got all of these for free? Well, to be honest with you, I had eight of the coupons for 55 cent off, and I, and I actually do like the Sweet Leaf Green Tea. I like these a lot. And so, um, and it, you know, you, I don't see them on sale too often, so I just decided, you know, I have eight coupons, so let me just use them. They were, they were a dollar Kroger, so I ended up paying 45 cents for each of them. So, like I said, even though I did get a whole bunch of those teas free, but I really like, I also love the sweet leaf tea and i just want to take advantage of the fact that i had the coupons and they're going to be expiring at the end of the month so i just wanted to take advantage of that <clears throat> and the dial soap i got three of them i actually have six coupons but um they only had three left and these are not even the scents i wanted I, because they dial has some really wonderful scents but i was like you know what i'm gonna waste time and gas trying to drive around to other kroger's so i just went and got a rain check um, because the cool by itself is going to expire on July 7th. And, you know, I just was like, you know, let me just get, cause soap is soap at the end of the day. So they're on sale for a dollar and we have those 35 cent off coupons, which I believe we got last weekend. And, um, yeah, we got those last weekend and the, those double to 70 cents. So you end up paying 30 cents for the dial. I had six coupons, but they only had three left. Apparently some other people had already cleared it off. So I made sure I went, went ahead and, and got a rain check and, um, yeah, when when those come back into stock, I could use my other three coupons. And um, the last thing I got was the Kroger cheese. These are on sale right now, today, Thursday through Saturday. The cheese will be on sale for not just the bar cheese, but also the um the shredded cheese are on sale for buy one get one. So I think it makes them like three dollars for both of them. And then um if you get the Kroger mailer. If Kroger sends you coupons, which they send me coupons all the time in the mail, you should have gotten a 70 cents off of any two Kroger cheese. So that will be about $2.30. So um, you should have those if you do get the Kroger um, items in the mail. So um, this transaction, I did um two separate transactions i did the two welch's juice and the eight balls of sweet tea and the um and the cheese together that was eight dollars out of pocket after coupons and then the bottles of tea the 47 bottles of tea and the dial i did those together and the my out of pocket expense it was over it was like 51 dollars for all of them and then my out of and then after the five after the 15 free bottles came off, it came down to like 30, I think it was like $31 or something like that, $30-something. And um, after coupon, I ended up paying $8.52 for all of the teas and the dial soap. Okay, because even if you get items free, you still have to pay the taxes. The three dollars, the three dollars soaps were ninety cents together, and then you know, even though those were all free, you still have to pay your taxes. So yeah, all of this was a dollar and fifty two cents. So all in all, everything on the table was less than ten dollars, like nine dollars and fifty two cents about. So that is it. So like I said, this deal is still going on. I I want to believe that the buy ten get five free deal. It's going to continue throughout next week, but I'm really not too sure. Um, I missed it last week because I couldn't find the tea. I don't think I was looking good enough, but you know what? It's just as well because I was able to find better coupons today, yesterday. So, and I think I'm going to go back to that CVS and see if I can get some more. So, um, that is it. So, like I said, I killed Kroger today with these drinks. 
Um, and like I said, I'm going to get some more. If you can get a hold of those coupons, go to the gas station, go to the drug stores, and just get them and clean up. Because you get Kroger is the best place to get these right now. And oh, I, this is the part I wanted to tell you guys. After he did the transaction with the Honest Tees, and the total was $1.52, that's when he waits to tell me that, oh, well, I'm doing this this time for you, but really, you can only do five coupons, five like coupons per transaction. So, I had heard about that, but I just decided, you know what, I'm just going to go on ahead and do it and see, because, you know, I've been to different Kroger's, and, you know, it really, sometimes they implement, sometimes they don't. It just depends if the cashier lets you get away with using more than five but um, I'm just like, if that was really the case, you should have said something from the beginning. But, I mean, he let me do it. But, you know, I'm just like, you know what? Well, thanks. You did me a favor. And, you know what? If I have to break up my transaction, then that's what I'm going to do. Um, I really hate the fact that they have it as five because they do those 10 for 10s all the time. If you can only use five coupons, then this deal is not going to benefit you unless you have a dollar off a of two coupon. But if you have those 50 cents off of one, you're going to need to use 10 coupons to get them all for free. So, that's pretty much the bottom line. So, I mean, I would suggest do break your transaction up in parts. Do 15, do 15. Because I think if you if you do up to 10 coup like coupons, I think you could get away with that without them saying anything. I had 32 of the iced tea coupons, so I think that's why he actually said something. But I, if you do up to 10, I think you can get away with them not saying anything, and then you just break up your transactions or have your kids do one for you or go to another line, whatever you got to do. So, all right, guys, so that is it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you guys got something out of it and you're able to do it yourselves. And um, that's pretty much it. And I will talk to you guys later in the next video. Okay, bye guys. Oh yeah, and by the way, subscribe, rate, and comment. See you in the next video. Bye.